was in support of staying in the village the last time around. Um, I, I think that things have gotten worse in the last three years since we voted on it originally. The roads have clearly gotten worse. Um, I see a lot of the services have declined um, or stopped altogether. I love the sense of community. That it, it, I always tell people it's like a, a large campground. I think that that when we have a community that we can take pride in again, mm -hmm. I think that the will have even more strength. If they vote yes on issue one to dissolve, everything is going to be lost. Everything. I just don't think it was thought out thoroughly. You know, if I guess say if they had known exactly what was going to happen, it would be different. I think, yeah. and it'd be different for both sides. Actually, yeah. you know, like I said. But nobody knows what's going on. It's like going, driving down a dark tunnel. You know, what's going to be at the other end? You don't know. Our little community, our little village is just in dire straits as far as finances. It's just mismanagement of funds. Okay. Um, we don't get grants. And with state cutbacks, we're just in a bad spot, which really just relies on our residents financially. And it's just at a point that it's time to let it go. Whether it's Franklin Township or Brady Lake, this community is going to be the same to my family and to our friends and our community. I think it is likely in the long run that we will need to become part of a larger entity and that that probably will and should be Franklin Township. However, I would like that to be a thoughtful and systematic process uh, not one that at the moment is filled with a great many unknowns and uncertainties. Um, I'd like to do things in a systematic way and I'd like to be sure that that's the direction we're headed. I love it here. Uh, my wife and I both do. We, we choose to live here. We are big fans of the village and of the Brady Lake area. It's less important to us that it be a village than that it remain the community that it is. And we hope to get past these issues and to get to a point where we have decent roads and good services and otherwise can go about our private lives.